Today, we're diving into some new insights on the crypto market and whether it's getting ready for a rebound. Sentiment, a leading crypto research firm, believes that certain keywords being used on social media might be our best clue. So if you want to know how to tell if the market has bottomed and when the next breakout might be coming, stick around. We're going to cover it all. All right, let's set the stage real quick. The price of Bitcoin has slipped by nearly 9% over the last few years days, mostly due to increased geopolitical tensions in the Middle East. And when something like this happens, crypto traders start to worry. What does this mean for risk assets like Bitcoins and altcoins? Uh, with everyone on edge, the market is looking for signs of where we're heading next. So here's where things get interesting. Sentiment, a crypto analytics firm, has put out a new theory that there are five keywords that you should keep an eye on across social media to see if the market is overly fearful and maybe, just maybe, ready for a rebound. According to Sentiment's director of marketing, Brian Quinlivin, um, these words tend to pop up when traders are feeling down. And when everyone's feeling these uh, FUD words, that's fear, uncertainty, and doubt, uh, for those who don't know, it could actually be a bullish sign that things are about to turn around. So first up, the first word is crash. When you see crash flooding your X feed, Discord servers, and Reddit threads, it usually means prices have taken a nosedive and panic is in full effect. Ironically, when crash is all anyone is talking about, that's often when prices start to recover. Sentiment often or even has data to back up this. Now, when uh, mentions of crash spikes, uh, Bitcoin's price historically begins to bounce back. It's almost like ever, the market is saying, all right, we've fallen enough. It's time to reverse. Now, let's talk about two other words that have a similar effect. Sell and dead. Just like crash, when people start shouting sell and calling coins dead, it means traders are in full panic mode. But here's the catch. This kind of negative talk is often a sign that we're approaching the bottom and a recovery could be just around the corner. Even um, uh, Quinn Livin even says that these moments can create opportunities for the brave. So if uh, someone who likes to kind of buy the dip, hearing these kind of words might actually be a great signal. All right, let's move on to that fourth keyword, crackdown. This one's all about regulation and legal pressure. It's the, if you've been in the crypto space for a while, then you will know how much the market can react to news of regulatory crackdowns, potential lawsuits, or legal uncertainties. It can make traders feel like the sky is falling. But according to sentiment, these moments of fear can actually bring about some of the best buying opportunities, especially if the panic seems overblown. Last but definitely not least is the word liquidation. This one is kind of a double-edged sword because it can mean different things depending on market conditions. Liquidations happen when traders are forced out of their positions because of a sudden price move, and it can happen in both bullish and bearish markets. On social media, you'll often see people celebrating uh, when those betting against the market, short sellers get liquidated or stopped out. And here's the cool part. Uh, Quinn Livin says that when short positions or shorts are liquidated uh, at high levels, it often is a great chance for new buyers to enter the market. So if you're seeing liquidation blowing up your social media, uh, it might be a signal that it's time to start looking for an entry point. Now, let's take, uh, let's, what's the takeaway, right, from all of this? Quinn Liffin suggests uh, taking a, a contrarian approach to social media sentiment. Basically, if anyone or everyone seems to be panicking and going all in on the bearish side, that's uh, when it's time to think about the contrarian, uh, basically. And if you see a lot of bullish hype, that's probably a time to be a bit more cautious. On the, the idea is to basically spot those extreme moments, uh, just like after the FTX collapse or the recent rate cut announcements, and take advantage of the herd mentality. And there you have it. The five key words to watch out for that could signal a market bottom. Crash, sell, dead, crackdown, 
and liquidation. If you're on social media and start seeing these words pop up a lot, it might be a sign that the market is overly fearful and ready to turn around. But remember, as with anything in crypto, it's all about staying informed and making decisions based on a full picture. What do you think? Are these keywords the secret source to spotting market bottoms or are they just another piece of the puzzle? Drop your thoughts in the comments down below or join us in our free Discord server. We would love to hear from you. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe and ring that bell so you never miss another update. And if you haven't done so already, check out this video right here. It's not one you're going to want to miss.